I don't know much about organic wine. All I know is that it's organic, which I know what organic foods mean, but I haven't really had experience with specifically what organic means for wines. Well, I, I think consumers are really confused um, about eco-certified wines. There are several different certifications. You have wine made with organically grown grapes, you have organic wine, and you have biodynamic wine. And most uh, consumers don't really know the differences, but the differences are pretty important. Wine made with organically grown grapes must, of course, meet all the organic certification requirements for the grapes themselves. On top of that, you can only add about one-third the normal amount of sulfites, the preservatives wineries use to keep product fresh. And then you have the real organic certification, organic wine, where you take the same grapes, they're organic, but in addition, you don't put any chemicals in the process of making the wine. However, you cannot keep that wine very long uh, just because you don't have the preservative. In addition to that, you have the biodynamic wine. Biodynamic wine sounds new age, but it uses traditional practices that date back hundreds of years. It uses the natural cycles of earth to dictate when you harvest, prune, and what are the vines. It is a holistic approach that makes the vineyard a closed system, which means the nutrients and organic matter are returned back to the soil. Bonterra was one of the first to have their wine certified as made with organic grapes. They now have three fully biodynamic vineyards. We started in the, in the late 80s with an organic approach. We, we strongly believe that this is the, the best way to steward the land, right? So in, in the biodynamic way, in the organic way, so we're not using synthetic inputs, we're using compost, we're using natural fertility cycles, cover crops, we're allowing the soil to be fed and, and grown through plants in, in a more natural cycle of soil genesis. We also, in the biodynamic way, we manage sheep or other livestock, other animals on the vineyard, so it harkens back to a full farming system. So for us, the winemaking process starts in the vineyard. It's all about the quality of the fruit that we grow. Then it comes into the winery, and the winery takes great care to maintain that quality through the, the process, fermentation, multiple fermentations and such that then come into the bottle. So what you get is, is a reflection of the vineyard, how we've cared for and farmed the vineyards organically and biodynamically, then translates into that bottle. The quality, the, the flavor, the taste of the produce being farmed organically is worlds apart. In general, so we find that people tend to see uh, wine made with organically grown grapes as, um, you know, not as good as conventional wine. Uh, only 30% uh, of those we interviewed said they had a positive uh, perception of the wine. And interestingly, those who tasted it tended to have a more positive, uh, you know, perception of it. So we found that eco-labeled wines are priced 7% below conventional wines. The cost of growing organic grapes is 15% more than conventional grapes. And the green wine puzzle is that two-thirds of the wineries that have eco-certification don't put organic or uh, made with organically grown grapes on their label. So they go through the process of getting certification and they don't want the consumer to know. Why? How do we find out if actually eco-certification leads to higher quality wine? We looked at uh, wine ratings from the three main experts, uh, wine enthusiast, wine spectator, and wine advocate. So we looked at 74,000 California wines, of which 800 were certified, and we compared the wines made with organically grown grapes to the more conventional wine. And what we found is that the eco-certified wines uh, have a higher rating than the conventional wines. On average, uh, they get 4% increase in quality for the uh, eco-certified wines. I think there is a lot of hope for the future of organic wine. Demand for organic product has grown annually by double digits since the 1990s, with organic sales increasing over tenfold from 3.6 billion in 1997 to over 39 billion by 2014.
47% of millennials are willing to pay premium prices for products that are made with organic ingredients. Consumers, especially millennials, are more conscious of sustainability issues, and of course, they like wine. <laughs>